بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته Dear brothers and sisters, I hope and pray everybody is well inshallah ta'ala. It's the year 2021. I remember it was 2005 I think or 2004 when I was invited by an organization here in the UK to conduct a course on the topic of marriage. It was in a small city, not a city but maybe a town called Loughborough which is very close to my city of Leicester at Loughborough University and uh, <clears throat> over a period of six or seven weekends I delivered a very detailed course on the fiqh and the spirit of marriage. I remember many brothers and sisters attended and after that uh, alhamdulillah they produced a CD set as well uh, based on that course. I During that time when I was preparing for uh, teaching that course I gathered a lot of notes and made some coursework material for that course. I can't believe that it's been you know, 15 years, 2005 and 2021. After that, for many years, uh, I've been delivering this course relating to marriage uh, in many cities across UK and in, abroad in many countries. I remember delivering this in um, <clears throat> America a few times, Chicago, Toronto, Canada, a couple of occasions, I think, uh, I've uh, delivered this course. Norway, I think, as well. Um, and even in the UK, many, many cities, I remember once a very detailed two full days around 2010, I think, I delivered this course. Because you see, this course on marriage, uh, it can be a very detailed course. There's a, there's a longer version, there's a shorter version, there's a condensed version. Sometimes it's just like a seminar or just like a two, three hour. Very, a lot of times people want a very, very, deep, a very simple, very short and condensed type of five hour, four hour course. Uh, but I remember once teaching the full detail one, which was till up from 9 to 5 p.m. on a Saturday and 9 to 5 p.m. on a Sunday. I think around 2010 or 11 in the city of Birmingham in the UK, I was invited by a Sofa Institute uh, who had organized this course. And we had a good 200 brothers and sisters who attended uh, this course, alhamdulillah ta'ala. So, alhamdulillah, I would like to uh, mention, and it's a pleasure to mention that this is the first time Hopefully, we here at Darul Ifta are offering this course online. The full course will be exclusively just online. Uh, the course is titled Journey of Love. Now, it's a marriage course, and I'm sure you have attended marriage courses or seminars or webinars or lectures or talks, but this is a very detailed course. It will be on <clears throat> both on, a, on the weekend, on the weekend of uh, Saturday 13th and Sunday 14th, March 2021, from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., with, with a few short breaks, but from 9 to 5 p.m. So that's a full, you know, weekend that you need to dedicate yourself to this course because the course is very detailed. Uh, that various topics we'll be discussing uh, will be relating to marriage, but from aspects and issues relating to pre-marriage, actual marriage itself, and after being married. So, like I was mentioning that I delivered this course for the first time in 2004, 2005, but over the years, the last 15 years, the course has improved. Uh, I have improved, hopefully, inshallah. Uh, you know, there's a, there's a improvement in the course. Notes have been added. Further notes have been added. There's, you know, involvement. There's an evolving of the course that has taken place. And recently, in the last two, three years, I've added many other things to it as well. So we have a course material, very detailed course material, I think 80, 90, maybe 100 pages that I've been adding to it over the last 10, 15 years. But all the topics from pre-marriage to from issues such as what is the definition of nikah and marriage and love in Islam? Like, what, what does love really mean? Is it what we think, you know, happy ever after, you know, yeah, I love you, you love me, let's, let me just put an umbrella over your head and, you know, when, when it's raining and that's it. I'm not saying that's not love, but this is what some people think that you didn't open the car door for me, so that's love. Okay, anything else is not love. What is the real meaning of love and marriage in Islam? So before marriage, uh, many issues in terms of how to select a suitable spouse who is good and ideal as a husband, as a wife, uh, and then engagement, then the nikah ceremony itself, all the rules, the fiqh and spirit of engagement, nikah ceremony, the walima, the 
first night, intimate relations, and then goes on to you know the rights and responsibilities of the spouses, the husband and the wife. Uh, and also towards the end, we have a very detailed discussion about addressing marriage problems. I've got a whole set of like 12, 13 uh, causes and reasons that cause the causes and reasons that result in the breakdown of marriage, causes of separation, causes of marriage problems, causes of divorce. Uh, and I will go through each of them. Each one, one of them requires a good 20, 30, half an hour explanation, like 10 major causes. And the course ends with a bit of fiqh in relation to divorce and separation and child custody, because that's also important to know, because it could be possible somebody could you know, undergo a divorce or someone in your family could undergo divorce. So it's a very comprehensive course. It's not just for people who are not married. I mean, I normally say it's for the people who are married, people who are planning to get married. So it, it will help you, inshallah, in your married life. Those who are already married, you know, it could help them as well. We all have issues in our marriages, problems in our marriages, how to tackle them, etc. And also, if, if, you're, if you're a bit older in age and you've got children of marriageable age, uh, it's also for you because especially in this day and age how to navigate through the issues of dealing with young children or sorry marriageable children of marriageable age they are young like early 20s they want to do go into a secret marriage there's so many cases that come to me the parents are not wanting them to get married to someone else but they want to get married to somebody else and parents are wanting them to get married to somebody else so forced marriages arranged marriages secret marriages and one really important issue that i always talk about in my marriage courses is to separate between Islam and culture. And this is a big issue. A lot of people need to know about this, especially parents need to know about this. There are many issues which are not Islamic, which are cultural. Whichever culture you come from, whether it's the Indian subcontinent or the Arab culture or the African culture or whichever culture. So it's not Islam per se. So a separation between cultural uh, practices and Islamic teachings. So inshallah, um, <clears throat> I hope that um, you will register for this course. Uh, once again, this course will be on the weekend of Saturday 13th March and Sunday 14th March 2021, 9am to 5pm. So you will have to dedicate a full weekend of your busy life, inshallah ta'ala. In terms of different time zone, diff recordings will be available. We've offered a course previously with our lifter as well and uh, the recordings are available for people at different time zones. So you can listen and you can watch the courses if you register according to your time zone and according to your convenience and the recordings actually then remain for two three four weeks as well i think four weeks around they remain and we use google classroom and things like that so it's a very good system that we have inshallah so hopefully uh, that you will register the link will be provided below this video to the course page where you can register and read in full the details and also read breakdown of all the topics that will be discussing on both days inshallah ta'ala jazakumullah ta'ala khairan assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh